Hey there, VR fishing family. This is Doc Cincy here, and welcome to my Epic Fish videos. And after this short intro, you will be taken to the video that you are looking for. And just wanted to, um, everybody likes to see people's lodges. So here's my lodge. I've got my, my shark trophies from the shark event. I've got, you know, all my, my trophy wall filled out, my various leaderboard medals. And um, I guess a more common one, people want to see people's saltwater aquariums. And I don't put any of my saltwater fish in my saltwater aquarium. Um, so in my saltwater aquarium, you will just find all my reward animals. And my um, spider crab is down there. I've seen some people, their spider crab kind of gets out and about. Um, my spider crab does not. I've never seen him anywhere but right in front of me. So let's get on to the fishing video that you are looking for. And um, please make sure you subscribe and check out my other videos. If you are having trouble landing sharks, I've got a great video on how to land sharks. If you are trying to get more sharks on your fishing line, I've got a video for that called my fish buffet. And that is just a way to increase the frequency that you get your sharks on. So on, let's get on to your video. Thanks and as always, happy hunting. Hey, Doc Cincy here, and we are on South Korea 19 catching the cobia. And I suggest you um, bring a snack or maybe a light lunch because this one can take a while. And this, this fish just doesn't show up a lot. Only one other distractor fish, but you will know when you got the cobia. It is going to be crawfish on bottom, casting at the bubbles, and you will get an instant bite. And when you hook it, it will run. There is one other fish that you might hook, but it will not run. An instant bite on the bottom is the line turning red by the time the bobber pops up or the bait hits the bottom. So it's not instant, instant. Um, let's see. So I've got two sets of bubbles and I just ran out. My rod just broke. That's hilarious. So I had two sets of bubbles out there. And, oh goodness. So now I gotta buy my rod. That means my reel probably is going to break here the next cast or so. So I have two sets of bubbles. I was looking at that light. I think it was just a little bit to the right of that light. Well, not that light, the bridge. Right in here. My bubbles disappear by the time I go to make my videos. <laughs> it's too far out. I know the general area. Point of position was that I call it the cone light. It's got yellow lights and then like a red cone under it. I was just to the right of that. It's a little bit almost dead on. I can't remember how far out I was and my bubbles are gone. Maybe we'll just keep fishing around until the bubbles reappear or I luck on top of it. I know he's out there or she's out there. I didn't think it was out very far though. This is probably it. But I want to show you that instant bite. There we go. Now that we've got the spot, I cast far enough. There we go. So by the time the bait hits the bottom, you should get the bite. That's what happens when your bubbles disappear. timing on my rod and reel here to have them break at the same time. Again, this fish does not show up that much. Probably the second least of the saltwater epics. The one that shows up the least is that Japanese bullhead shark or what I like to call the Japanese
Again, crawfish on bottom, casting at the bubbles. Gonna be an instant bite. If you hook the fish that does not run, it is not the coat. So best of luck, and as always, happy hunting.